so guys once again welcome back to coding cafe so i as i just say in the previous video we will continue our work from here so let's start so now we will we are inserting the post into the database okay so insert into post and then if you don't understand what i did then watch the previous video okay so now so the first option in the data real database is the user id and the next one is the post underscore content and and after the post content the next one is the upload underscore image and then the last one is i think the post underscore date and then over here we will just type values yes values and uh, then the first one will be the total user underscore id and then the next one will be the i think no no just remove this no from here we will just type the content because we are echoing the content and the image both together so and after the content we will echo the upload image i mean insert the upload image name and uh, and uh, we will echo the random number also so that the image is not exchanged with each other and after the random number the date will be now and then brackets and i think that's it and now we will create another variable dollar run and it will be equals to my sqli underscore query and then the dollar connection variable and then the dollar insert variable and uh, if it's run successfully or if the dollar run variable acts successfully then we will echo just copy all of that to echo from the up and just paste it down below and uh, we will change this to so i just pause the video and i just typed it to your post updated a moment ago and then we will direct them to the home.php file and now save this and now if we just scroll down and one thing more now we will update the users table we will set the let me just show you we will now just set that post to yes because the user have inserted in post if this query is run so for that we will type update and i think it will be equals to a query and the query will be update users and uh, we will set the post will be equals to yes and then we will type where where the user underscore id will be equals to the dollar user underscore id variable and uh, then we will just create a variable run underscore update and it will be equals to my sqli underscore query and then we will just pass the first we will pass the dollar connection variable and then the dollar update variable and that's it and after this uh, early bracket we will exact all of that so the code will not move on so after our our here we will just type else we'll type else again and then we will type inside this else condition we will type if dollar content is uh, equal equals to null if the user not enter anything i mean if this text area is empty and uh, also he didn't upload any image so for that we will type upload will be equals to nothing and then type and and so if these both conditions are true 
if the user not upload any image or no or not type any kind of text so then we will just echo that error occurred while uploading and then we will redirect them to the home.php file so now in the else condition uh, if the user want to only upload an image so for that we will type a uh, query so if dollar content is equal equals to null so if the content i mean this content is uh, equals to null if the user enter nothing okay then it means that he will select an image so for that over here we will type dollar content where we could equals to null and then we will type move uploaded file or we'll just copy that from there to make our work simpler and easier to understand so just paste it over here and that will be the same I think yes and move this n wait let me check yes okay so it's all right so we will just uh, move the uploaded file to the images post and uh, remove this to outside and let me check that another one where is it so it's all right so now and I think we need to remove this one also okay so now we need only one bracket so that's it and now we will just uh, copy this insert query and after that over here we will just paste it and the query will be insert into post user id post content upload image post date values will be the dollar user id and this content will be equals to no because the user is only uploading the image so it will be equals to no and uh, the image will be that same and that's it and uh, now we will just copy that run variable and that if condition and also the exact so just copy all of that code and uh, just paste it down below and let me just and that's it so if it's work then we will just type your post updated successfully and we will redirect them to the home.php file and update post will be equals to that's it the we will update the user table and post will be equals to yes and where user underscore id will be there and we we'll pass the total connection variable and then the update variable and after this exact after this curly bracket over here we will type else so now if the user only want to uh, update uh, his post i mean in the textual input so that's why we just add else okay so if this is not equals to then we will just type else and uh, the query will be the same so we will just copy all of that code and uh, paste it down below and the query will insert into post yes and user id post content and uh, for this time we will remove this uh, image to or we will just uh, leave this empty so remove this one and remove this upload image okay so now we will just go pass the total connection variable and then the insert and if the run variable acts successfully then we will just type your port up, up your post updated a moment ago and uh, we will redirect them to the home.php and update we will update the users table and uh, i think that's it and i hope you understand all of that code and if not we will provide the source code till this video in the description so check out the source code okay so now i think that's it 
so now we need to include this function.php file on the header.php file so in the includes folder header.php we will just remove that not remove that we will just copy that and paste it down below and we will change the directory to so it is in the functions folder i think and the file name is uh, functions.php so now let's refresh our page and uh, try to post something so let's do it so now if we refresh our page we got not no errors so let's type hello world and let's just select an image and we will select uh, which one i think this one we'll click open and then click on the post your post updated a moment ago so the post will not display over here because we didn't create a functions for the for that so if we check our post table here is our first post the post content is hello world and the image name is the upload image i mean the aaa and then dot jpg and the random number so now our post is now updating into our i'm not updating i mean inserting in our database so that's good for us for me and in the next video we will design our home.php file and we will uh, display the post of the users okay so this is it for this video and if you are new to our channel then subscribe our channel coding cafe and press the bell icon